he has returned, Josh Richardson. It's been a few seasons, and now he comes back to Miami. You guys know I'm about to go to graduate school at the University of Miami, and I'm so happy Josh Richardson coming back. He was on the Pelicans this year, and now he's going to be a Miami Heat once again. Okay, what a good story. What a great player in Josh Richardson, and he's a guy who... Wherever he's gone, he has been able to shoot the lights out of the ball. And a good signing, low-key signing by the Miami Heat. They drafted in 2015, eight years ago. Now he returns. Sham Sharania put out the news. They signed him to a two-year deal. He's a guy who's a swingman. He can play both the shooting guard and the small forward position for this team. And he'll be a guy who definitely is going to be a huge help for a team that needs, you know, they, they're they hoping to be able to keep their guys, but they've already lost Gabe Vincent. They're going to need some three-point shooting. And Josh Richardson's a guy who last year for the Pelicans, he shot 38% from three, 42% from the field, seven and a half points. And then with the Spurs, he was averaging 11 and a half points, 36% from three, and for his career, he's a guy who's averaged 12 points, 36% from three. Career high 16 points with the Heat that year that they made it to the NBA Finals, I believe it was. Again, lost to the Lakers. And Josh Richardson at this point, he's a swingman with size and length. He's able to play with the ball in his hand or off it. Off the ball, he's a pretty decent spot up three-point shooter, catch and shoot. On ball, he actually is a solid scorer and shot creator out of the pick and roll. He loves that pull-up short mid-range jumper and is a legit defender is a bit underrated in my opinion guarding one through three and he's been given the opportunity to do more offensively and at times has excelled at other times we won't sit here and be like he was insane but Josh Richardson's definitely a guy that I think we need to give credit and I really I really think it'll be something fun to watch with him back on the heat all right he's definitely definitely a good pickup for this miami heat team probably a cheap one too that they didn't have to to pay too much money for and for me i think he's a guy that if you hadn't been following him this past year he's still a deadly deadly three-point shooter who's fun to watch who has skill and can make plays off the balance a little bit. It's got a little bit of jig.